eight seconds remaining in regulation of the AFC championship game. Cincinnati has one timeout left if they want to freeze Harrison Butker. Again, going right to left. The wind is tricky. Cold night. 20 to 20 time. It's been a, a tough year for me. I mean, obviously, I've missed some kicks, some big kicks, and I haven't really done that in my career, so I was facing a lot of adversity. Let's go, baby. You got it, Buck. This year taught me a lot about just keeping the faith, focusing on what I can control. Come on, man. Come on, Buck. I remember after the Texans game, Patrick sat down next to me and he told me, you know, we're going to need you when it comes down to the playoffs. And sure enough, 45-yard field goal, right hash uh, to send it to the Super Bowl. Harrison Butker, the biggest kick of his Chiefs life. Butker's kick is up. The spinning kick high, floating in the air. And it is... Be able to be in that game, it's a dream. It's something that uh, you dream about as a little kid, but you dream about winning it. A chance to win it all. I think just about anybody who plays the game envisions themselves playing for a Super Bowl. Dream I always chased since I was a little kid, play at the big dance in the Super Bowl. That's the whole reason I came to Kansas City, to be a part of this. But we're not done yet, we got one more, man. Let's get it. No matter what team I'm on, what jersey I'm wearing, like, it don't matter like who I'm surrounded by, like, that's always my end goal. And to be here and be around this group of guys and group of coaches, like, there's nothing more I can ask for pretty much. How about those? That's what I'm talking about, baby. Back to the Super Bowl. The work's not done. The work's not done. I think anyone who plays this game wants to experience that opportunity to raise the Lombardi Trophy, not only to raise it, but to have a ring, to say that you was a part of something bigger than yourself. The Chiefs are going to end the season where they began the season, in Glendale, Arizona, at Super Bowl 57. I just hope that, you know, when the game's all said and done and it's finally all over that next week, that, you know, all our fans, all the supporters just know that, you know, we gave it our all this year and we're here, so job's not done. It is officially Super Bowl week six. Long days now until the Eagles and the Chiefs face off in Arizona. But first, they both touch down in Phoenix on Sunday. This week is kind of, you almost treat it much like a normal week. Tomorrow's normal Thursday, Friday's normal Friday. Then you travel on Sunday. This has been a long, hard climb. When you go 21 seasons and don't call a playoff victory at all, you wonder what it would be like to be, you know, the Patriots in their heyday or teams that win consistently like the Steelers and others, and that's what the Chiefs have been for 10 years. But now, when you get Patrick Mahomes a quarterback, you're thinking, let's go for it. The Chiefs have changed pretty dramatically since their last Super Bowl, which was what? Four years ago now they won a Super Bowl. They've been to another one since. I'm not saying that you can say dynasty if the Chiefs lose. I'm not trying to claim that. But I think if you win, you can have a very real conversation that this is what you're witnessing. This Philadelphia team does not have a weakness. To me, it's very similar to the way the Chiefs have built their team. I'm going to be really curious to watch Philadelphia go up against a team that I think can attack them in a lot of different ways. And also, Andy has two weeks to watch that team. And I know you don't see a weakness. <laughs> Andy's going to find one or two Something. things. Hey, they don't do this really well. That's where the Chiefs have the biggest advantage other than number 15 uh, in this game, is that they have a coaching staff that's been in these moments before. That's, they have won a yeah. ring together. 
the more that, that the, the people continue to doubt this football team, the more I'm confident that they're going to go out there and they're going to win this game. I do like the fact that seemingly everyone continues to pick Philadelphia, and everybody in Philly is really, really confident. And looking at Andy Reid, bye week, 28-4 and four after the bye and things like that, I I'm feeling more confident as the week has continued. If you play the Chiefs, they are difficult to play if you only see them every so often. And I think that's a big advantage going into this game and just the Andy Reid advantage. You can't win the game this week, but I think you can lose the game this week. Coach right here in the front. You, you've talked for a while about blocking out distractions. What, what's the toughest part about this week? I'd probably tell you just the magnitude of the media. Well, it takes you out of your normal routine. You try to keep as close to that as possible, but you've got media obligations like this. Patrick Mahomes and uh, the Chiefs spoke today. They speak one more time tomorrow, the players do. The coaches speak one more time after that. Extra media availability every day. All of that is stuff the Chiefs have gone through three times. Yeah, there's some newcomers on this team, but the coaching element and just be, being able to go through the process, they're far more experienced in that. Great. Morning. I threw the bike focus on, you know, the light, it's the lights. You know, I'm real big on lights. It's the lights though. You know, I knew coming to this, this joint, the lights was gonna be all in my face. Last time we I was like sweating chickens. So I'm like trying to figure it out, you know what I mean? That's all. I got you. Well, you like the bright lights. That's when you make your biggest plays. Rihanna came out and said that you are the greatest quarterback ever. Hearing that, how does that make you feel? Uh, it, makes me, it makes you feel great. Whatever Rihanna says is like like the gospel, so I'm glad that she, she went with me for that for that honor. She did. <laughs> she oh, did. I was just her. <laughs> oh, man. So tonight is opening night. We'll head over to the Suns Arena. Philadelphia Eagles will be first up, and the Chiefs will do the exact same thing. Oh, yeah. You're crazy, man. We're here again. Yeah, I'm here for the first time. What I tell you, though, what I told him. I told him for the AFC Champion, I said, hey, you got them 100 sacks. I said, we finna cement your legacy right here. I'm, we take you to a Super Bowl, Carlo. First time you look back on after, uh, to me, I'm just I'm just trying to do whatever I can to continue to move forward um, and continue to be my best. And so, after my for a TV station in St. Louis. Okay. Okay. So did you ever think when you were a um, player? Let me use this, I will. Of course. One day. What's up, Colin? How are you? Hey, what's going on, boss? Let's go and ask me what's tough. Okay. Can you hear me real quick? Is that yeah, cool? absolutely. I mean, I know. Cody and Gold live in Arizona. We are on Radio Row, day number one of our coverage here. And were they practicing Arizona State? I, I yeah. guess it is. I was just about to say, you noticed the ankle didn't even come up yet. I mean, he's still not going to be 100%. You're dealing with a high ankle sprain. So Mahomes' ankle won't be 100%, but now you're getting the extra week. And obviously, everybody saw what he was able to do just with five days uh, coming off of the injury in the Jacksonville game. What? You ready for a good day? Today? Yep. Always.
you think when you're doing the game, what would you say when it happens? And think about it, I had a long time to think about what I would say, because you're really narrating history. Missouri State, native Kansas. But the analogy of the climb came oozing out at the end of that game in Super Bowl 54 when I said the Chiefs Kingdom has firmly planted its flag on top of football's highest mountain. The game is over, and the Chiefs Kingdom has firmly planted its flag on top of football's highest summit. I wanted every man, woman, and child who considers themselves part of the Chiefs Kingdom to feel like they were part of that climb, because they were. And for that moment to happen, I was thinking this could be a once in a lifetime experience. But to think three and four years, man, you gotta stretch your imagination to think that that was in the realm of possibility. But here we are. School photo! It really started in March. I gotta show off all my TV. I remember an NFL Network interview I did with Andrew Siciliano. The Chiefs, with the arms race Mitch that we've seen the last month in the AFC West. Have they fallen behind? Where he asked me, as the AFC West passed you by? And I could feel the fur go up on the back of my neck. Four straight AFC Championship games. Is it fair to say with the offseason moves that they've fallen behind in the division? I answered him with a question. I said, is the coach still here and the quarterback still here? The quarterback is the most successful start to any quarterback in NFL history. When you look at most of the metrics, including winning. I mean, in four years, he's got eight playoff wins against six division titles. What that did, though, was create the sense of urgency that I felt seriously in June. I felt it in July. Every day was this trying to prove that the Chiefs still belong, and not only belong, but they belong at the highest level. Truthfully, I think it's the most underrated facet of Andy Reid's brilliance in the fact that he plans it and that every day matters. You're gonna have an April OTA. Andy Reid has got a very definitive goal for whatever that April day is so he can get to the next day. It is a progression. All of it works together. It is why his September record is great. It's why training camps are so productive. Let's go. It's why a Chad Henney can go 98 yards playing in his second playoff game in 15 years because he was prepared for that moment as well as everybody around him in April. Andy is such a facilitator and planner to realize that the entire calendar matters to right now. It's easy to take it for granted. Everybody should just back up and go, oh my gosh, this is a well-oiled machine that is rare, not just in the National Football League, but in all of professional sports. Come on, come on. You just really have to soak it all in. Some of you have waited your entire life to be able to say the Chiefs are Super Bowl champions like we saw a couple years ago and may have the opportunity to do again. Some of you have waited your entire life for those memories, for those moments, for the Chiefs to draft one of those transcendent players on your team. In order for Andy and Patrick Mahomes to really sit alongside the Belichick and Brady's, the Nolan Bradshaw, the Landry and Staubach, the Walsh and Montana. They have to win on Sunday. We already won this game. We won this game with everything we did all offseason. Everything you did in college, everything you did in high school. All the work, baby. Today's just payday. It's been special. But it don't mean we don't finish, man. It don't mean we don't finish. We come here for one goal, just finish and take what's out. We gotta depend on you, 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 you. When they talk about a brotherhood, every play is a brotherhood. Cause we depending on the next man to do his job, man. Dominate on three, man. One, two, three. Now. It's a stretch of dominance like we saw with the Patriots, like we saw with the Steelers, the Cowboys. That's what the Chiefs are in the middle of. How you cap that off is by winning a championship on Sunday. I can't wait. Woo! I can't wait. They in trouble. This is what it feels like, huh? Yes, sir. Good. Great, baby. Wait till we win this. We here. We here now. What are we gonna do with it? What are we gonna do with it? Now that we just came to the party, it's time to dance. It's time to dance.
the dance. Hey, embrace this moment. Everything we work for is for this moment. Right here. Embrace that. Right here. Everything you got for the guy standing beside you. It's gonna take everybody. everybody. Let's go out there and find a way to drag our ass across the finish line. Let's go win a game. Chiefs on three, one, two, three. Chiefs. Now the Kansas City Chiefs back in the Super Bowl and they're bringing a team with a perfect mixture of youth and experience, superstars and rookies. And oh, by the way, they have the MVP and a pretty good tight end. The Kansas City Chiefs! The Kansas City Chiefs prior to Andy Reid's tenure as head coach had moments from the 1970 to 2012 seasons, a span of 43 years. Kansas City won three playoff games and played in one AFC Championship game. Since Andy's arrival, seven straight AFC West Championships, a Super Bowl 54 title, three Super Bowls in four years, and now the Chiefs of 2018 to 2022 are listed with the Cowboys of the 90s, the Steelers of the 70s, and the Patriots of the 2000s for dominance. Tonight in Glendale, Arizona, Super Bowl 57, Andy Reid's two great transformational masterpieces collide for the Lombardi Trophy. You feel it in your chest, man. Don't get no better than this. Don't get no better than this. For the land of the free and the whole of the Lead us, dog. Lead. lead us, lead us, lead us. Yes, sir. Have some fun, boy. Love you, big dog. Let's go get us Love another you, one, huh? Let's go. Love you, bro. Stay healthy. Congrats for being there, baby. How about this, huh, big guy? Love you. Love you, big guy. Hey, Do your thing, man. Hey, you see her up there? Hey, hey, Seth. Do your thing, hey. five, five. Ain't nobody scared all y'all out here. Y'all boys come out five deep. We three deep. What's good? <laughs> Let the hell out of here. Stay out there. Stay healthy, huh? Let's have some fun. Trying to score tutties, baby. You don't gotta worry about me. You strapped. May God bless you. May God bless you. Man, this be taking all day. <laughs> Dang. Super Bowl 57. Here we go. Let that loose today, man. For sure. You know that's why we get loose. For sure. Interesting decision right off the bat. The Chiefs giving the ball to Philadelphia. They're the best team in the league starting the game. Yeah, everything, this entire identity of this Philadelphia Eagles team is to how fast can I get the lead? Miles Sanders, 1,000 yard rusher. And he'll get it on first down. He's plugged initially. Now gets to the right side. The Chiefs will string him out and hit him hard. And we told you about opening drives. They've been absolutely lethal. You're talking about 10 touchdowns. They've had one three and out on the opener all year long. Both playoff games, opening drive touchdowns. Yeah, and this formula has really been hard for their opponents to crack. The idea is if we can get our opponents to play from behind, but this offense's ability to close games out as a running team is what separates them from so many others. It's a RPO play, and they throw it right side. It's caught inside the 25. Smith breaks a tackle up the right sideline. Chiefs tackling from behind. And hey, let's go into the bell, baby. Huh? This is going to be tough because you're likely going to see Jalen Hurts, probably a quarterback sneak with a push behind him. We got a lot of big bodies in there. Take a look how many guys are inside there. <laughs> got to go for it. Surging forward is Hurts. No signal yet. It is a one-yard quarterback sneak by Jalen Hurts. The Eagles have thrown the first punch and played downhill. They're going to do that in Super Bowl 57. We good. We good. And the Chiefs will have their first drive start at the 25-yard line. Let's go do what we do, do what we do, do what we do. No place you'd rather be, baby. Let's go, let's go! Energy, baby, energy! They've got to make this a race to 30. In their minds, every possession they have to maximize, every play that Patrick Mahomes can end up with the ball in his hands. 
the better it is for the Kansas City Chiefs. Mahomes will throw it, fires it over the middle. He's got Kelsey at the 40, the 45, and up near midfield. Mahomes roll out. Ankle looks just fine there. He slides down. And here comes jet action. They're going to give it on the left side. It goes to Pacheco, breaks a tackle, 35. Downfield block inside the 25 and rolls down to the Philadelphia 19-yard line. to go, first quarter, Super Bowl 57. Second and eight, Kansas City at the Philadelphia 18. 7-0 Eagles. Set. Mahomes spread set two by two with Pacheco on the backfield. Mahomes in the pocket, floats a pass. Kelsey over the shoulder, he's got the catch, he's got the touchdown! Kansas City, a beautifully thrown ball as Mahomes to Kelsey, 18 yards. We thought coming into this game, Kevin, if they want to play man, they might be okay on the outside, but who is going to guard Travis Kelsey inside? Go! Let's go! They have no answer. We're here! We're here! We're here! Red! your world! Hey, that's the way to answer it. Here we go! More! More! All day! Hey, all day! All day! All day! Way to set the tempo! All day! All day! All day! Hurts goes right down the field, runs it in. Mahomes takes his team right down the field, throws a touchdown to Travis Kelsey. And so we're all square at seven. Feels like a three-point shootout early in this game. More, 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 more. Let's go. Eagles the best in the NFL on third down conversions in the playoffs. They have third and 14 here at their own 21. <laughs> Hertz takes the snap, being pressured, and he's going to be throwing the football away, chased by Frank Clark. Now the Chiefs get a three and out and a chance to potentially take the lead. Third and three here now for Kansas City at the 24 of the Eagles. Roll out. Mahomes breaks away. Shuttle pass dangerous and incomplete. T.J. Edwards had an opportunity there. And now fourth down and three. Harrison Buckers coming onto the field. This will be a 42-yard attempt from the near hash. And the kick is no good. He misses it wide left. And the Chiefs lose their opportunity to take the lead. Let's go, right, I got it. And so a good drive ends with the doink. Hey, we gotta be better, baby. We just gotta be better. We gotta find a way to be better. Ain't no point fingers, we just figure it out. Jalen Hurts back at a quarterback. Five of seven, 59 yards. No, it doesn't. Eagles go big in this formation, flipping to Dallas Goddard, who cuts across the 45. And a nifty little play to get Goddard all the way up across the 47 yard line. Hurts has all day loaded a shot looking for A.J. Brown he's got it touchdown so instead of the Chiefs taking either a 14 to 7 lead or a 10 7 lead they get neither on a missed field goal it was a bad situation it's all good it's all good hey we stay together that's what happened it's all good we good well Patrick Mahomes responded after the last Eagles touchdown. What does he have in store here? Pacheco goes off tackle, but he'll get hammered for a loss of two. Mahomes over the middle, incomplete. And the Chiefs are three and out after the Eagles touchdown. Hey, make sure we tighten up our own. We're doing our 111, man. Make sure we're doing our 111. 111. We don't point fingers. We do not point fingers. Okay? We good. Go quick to the line of scrimmage. Likely a quarterback sneak again to get this first down. And here they come. They surround Hurts from behind. Chiefs are saying there's a false start. 
Yes, sir! Y'all can't do that! And they're now back in their own territory at their own 48-yard line. Big time, D. Big time, D. Big time. Spread set. Hurts by himself in the backfield. Threat to run and throw. Crouches down. He wants to run it. Oh, the ball's out. He kicks the ball. It's picked up by Kansas City. They're going to the 20, to the 10, to the 5. Touchdown, Kansas City. The second touchdown of the career for Nick Bolton. Thankful for longer timeouts here at the uh, Super Bowl, right, guys? As uh, Nick Bolton had that scoop and score, he was finding oxygen on the sidelines, trying to get the breath back. Hey, stay locked in, stay locked in. Let's go, let's go. When it's our turn, we got to be ready. When it's our turn, we got to be ready. We hear so often about Jalen Hurts is his consistency, how he keeps his composure and calm regardless of situation. Oh, we'll see how he reacts to the Eagles' first turnover of this postseason. 14-14 tie, first and 10, Philadelphia. Chiefs push the pocket. They'll swing it to the right flat. It goes to Scott. He jukes McDuffie, jukes another defender, and he's near midfield and up to the 48-yard line. Rally, 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 rally. Sets up this third and real short. Feels like we were just in this exact situation. Remember, before that fumble. So it's third and one. Go for the sneak, and they have it easily. Let's keep these things on stop. No matter what you do, bro. Time of possession, 15 plus minutes for Philadelphia. They have third and six here. They're going to run it, and they come up the middle, and the Chiefs stone him for one yard. Now, here's Philadelphia. They were playing to go for it on fourth down. They're going to have fourth and five here. They've gone for it for three times in the postseason on fourth down. They've made it every time. And five, they're going to snap it on a QB draw. Hurts angling to the near side, and sets a tackle. He's at the 30. He's at the 20 and then gets all the way down to the Kansas City 15 yard line. We've seen Jalen Hurts do this all year and that's the attitude. That's the aggressive nature of Nick Sirianni. They are gonna keep the pedal down the entire game. Dig deep now, dig deep, let's go. Dig deep, let's go. Now the Eagles have first down and goal to go at the four yard line at 2.39 to go. Chiefs have not even had the ball at all in the second quarter. Quarterback draw, left hurts, left side, touchdown. We don't win this game, it's the D-line fault. We got, it. we got too many undisciplined plays. Out of us, out of us, be disciplined. All right, fellas, hey, let's end this half with points yes, sir. with the ball. Yes, sir. Here's the deal, Dana. We talk about it all the time. You got a chance to get two straight scores here and take the lead. If you can one. score here, you'll get the ball to start the third quarter. 21 14, Philadelphia. Kansas City, all three timeouts. And here's Mahomes. Pressure in his face. Going deep out of scaling a turn around. They couldn't find it, and it's incomplete. And Philly's thinking they might get the ball back now. Chiefs have the ball at their own 31. And Mahomes trying to stay alive, bounces off the first hit. And he'll throw it across his body, an incomplete one hopping to the intended receiver. Third and 15, Chiefs at their own 31 ball, slow on the snap. Picked up by Mahomes at his shoe top. Trying to fight for more time to run. He'll scramble, he's at the 35, but he's ankle tackled there at the 36. And he's hurt. Spray he suffered against Jacksonville in the divisional. He rolled it. <laughs> Yo. 
now. What we were afraid of, even with that ankle and how he, well he played him in the AFC Championship, we just knew that maybe a tweak, and he's in agony on the sideline right now, Mitch. Nightmare material here for Kansas City. To make matters worse, now you're giving the ball back to Philadelphia about a minute 30, and they still have two timeouts. A 21 to 14 Philadelphia lead. To throw is Hurts. He's got a wheel route on the near sideline. Pass is caught on the shoulder down to the Kansas City 13 yard line. And so his quarterback sneak mode and Hurts chucks forward again. I mean, he was hit behind the line of scrimmage, but it didn't even matter. 35 yard field goal attempt for Jake Elliott. Go! Oh! And Elliott's kick is good. And the Eagles get the last points of the half. Baby. We don't get frustrated in this draft. We just find a way to get this done, you feel me? Patrick Mahomes will tend to that ankle. Chiefs do get the ball first in the second half. The Eagles lead at halftime, 24 to 14 over the Kansas City Chiefs in Super Bowl 57. It's halftime at the Super Bowl, which means coming up after a break, Rihanna will hit the world stage in the Apple Music Super Bowl 57 halftime show. The National Football League welcomes you to the Apple Music Super Bowl 57 halftime show. A little bit out of sync right now. Defensively, definitely offensively, and some of the special teams, but that's what halftime's for. That's what the extended halftime is for. For Kansas City, it's how do they stop Philadelphia? The Eagles have been aggressive, and really, except for the fumble defensive touchdown, they haven't been stopped. Yeah, and we started the broadcast when Philadelphia got the ball first after Andy Reid decided to decline after winning the coin toss. We said everything about their DNA, the fabric of this team, is how do we get a lead as fast as possible? Yeah. That's exactly how the first half went. And I have full confidence in Steve Spagnuolo, Dave Tobe, Eric Bieniemy, and Andy Reid that they're going to right the ship and get everything back and steal the momentum. Because right now, the Eagles have the momentum. You drive the field and score like you did earlier in this game. Quiet everybody down, quiet the sideline down, and they recognize that they're in for a dogfight. Glendale, Arizona, halftime of Super Bowl 57. The Chiefs trailing the Philadelphia Eagles 24 to 14. Both teams traded opening drive touchdowns. Come on now. That's what we do, dog. Come on, man. You let's know I'm going to give everything for you, dog. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Honestly, if you're sitting here in your Philadelphia and you took two weeks to computer generate the first half you wanted, that's what they got outside of the scoop and score. And honestly, this has been their script all year long. What we're seeing and you're hearing tonight from the Eagles is what they have done all year. Set. First and 10, Chiefs. Big rush on Mahomes. Steps up on the pocket, throws it late. Ah. And a catch made by Kelsey at his shoe tops. <laughs> Out of the shotgun, Mahomes throws it late. Catch made over the middle, diving catch at the 25. That one, they want. Justin Watson, a gain of 12. Keep digging, boy. Set. What's that? Snap to Mahomes on second and three. Now he slips, stays alive, keeps the ball in the right hand. He'll run it. He's at the 15, got a first down, slips inside a defender, gets all the way to the Eagle five. Looking, that's going to take off. Has the first down, still on his feet. Mahomes down to the five. He will gain 12 yards and a scramble and a bad ankle. Oh, what, Pat? Got to put it in. Got to put it in. Well, I mean, what an impressive drive here to start the third quarter. Just a great job by the you offensive know, line. They've needed to put one together. That's to play of the drive. Second down, goal to go at the one. They hand it off, left guard, it goes, touchdown, Kansas City! Isaiah Pacheco yeah. blasting in behind the block of Joe Tooney, the left guard, and the Chiefs get a badly needed touchdown drive. Let's go, we right in it. Just keep that going, that's a great drive. 
You talk about making a statement coming out of halftime. Andy Reid dialed him up, and Kansas City's back in it. Now the extra point by Bucker is up and good. Well, can the Chiefs back within three? Hey, that's all y'all. That's all y'all. That's all y'all. Hey, that's all y'all. Rest of the game. That's all y'all. More, 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 Hey, hey, that's who we are right there. Ain't no relax. That's who we are no right there. Relax. Don't forget Ain't no relax. Relax. Flawless. Relax. Flawless. Let's go. We're us. That's flawless. Hey, keep bringing it. Keep bringing it. Huh? Keep bringing it. Let's go. The tone has been reset in this game, Mitch. I just feel really confident about this Chiefs defense right now. Continue to make these plays. Stay the course. First and 10, Eagles at the 19 of the Chiefs. Hurts keeping the feet alive, chased by Colin Saunders as he will force him out of bounds. Colin Saunders on the chase, no gain on the play. So that is the first sack of the day by anyone. Colin Saunders will get credit for it. Second 11, Philadelphia at the 20 of Kansas City. Eagles by three. Hertz will throw it as Goddard slipped, and then the pass is incomplete. Bro, it's coming. It's coming. We're going to need big time. Big time from you, bro. Stay locked in, baby. And now it's third and 11. Philly, can the Chiefs win on third down? This is the key play in this game. But Dana, they've converted third and six on this drive and third and 13. This is third and 11. Hertz retreats on the throw. Near side throw goes to Gainwell at the 15. Surrounded, and Bolton takes him down. Just a gain of four. And the Eagles will try to go up by six, but what a win by Kansas City, and Colin Saunders started it all. Here's Jake Elliott from 33 yards right down the middle. That's how you fight. That's how you fight. That's how you fight. That's all hard right there. A seven-minute, 45-yard drive, 17 plays, but you have a chance to take the lead if you can go get a touchdown here. Left hash, left hash. Set. In the pocket, Mahomes with time. Over the middle, Juju Smith-Schuster catch at the 30. A pickup of 14 yards. Oh, 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 oh. More, more, more. Now they're going to throw it left sideline. Caught by Smith-Schuster. First down. We told you about this Eagles defense sack-wise being a store. Third best all time. Chiefs offensive line has really done an amazing job. No sacks allowed and really not too many pressures either. They will have third down and three at the Eagles' five-yard line. Chiefs are one of four on third down conversions. Hey, you, you, dig, dig, dig on this one. They have third down and three here at the Eagles' five-yard line. On you, don't do a left, dirty X out of 35 wet corn dog. Control, under control. Chiefs have not led in this game. They trail 27-21. They're going to throw a quick pass to Tony. He's got it on the edge. He will walk into the end zone. Touchdown, Kansas City. Kadarius Tony couldn't be more wide open. Hey, hey, my goal. No, no, no. Way to be great, dog. Totally wide open, one of the best targets on the sidelines that we have had this season. A short stint for him, but he gets a big play here. Second half, this offense has come alive. Great call. Great call. Great call. Great call. Great call. Yeah. That's, why you, that's why you keep your head up there and over there, right? Yes, you never know. Huh? Yes, you never know when those two come I'm always like being a coach. And a baby. And a baby. We're going to be under control, boy. It's been a tale of two halves here, Kevin. Patrick Mahomes fired up. More, 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 more. It's coming, dog. It's coming. More. I got more. I need that heart out. Pour your heart out, boy. Need more. Need more. 
people. Keep pouring your heart out, dog. You, 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 you're the energy. You're the lifeline, dog. Defense now has to step up. I love what Patrick Mahomes told us this week. You know, we've been in a lot of close games. I know our KC fans have been nervous about it. They don't like it, but we have a lot of experience. Great job. We ain't done. Great job. We're not done. That's all y'all. That's all y'all. We're not done. A lead for the Chiefs. It's the first time Philly has trailed this entire postseason. And 12.04 left to go in this one. Hey, hey, D. Hey, let's not think too big. Three and out. That's all we need. Hey, fine. Three and out. Three and out. One play at a time. Philadelphia only had one fourth quarter come from behind victory. First and ten of their own 25-yard line. Hurts in trouble trying to get it over there. The catch is made to Goddard somehow. He's going to pick up four yards or so. It was Dunlap with the pressure. Second and six, Philly. Quick throw. Immediate tackle made by Thornhill. Chiefs getting off the ball extremely well here, Mitch. Getting pressure. Third and two, and here they are. The Eagles again with third down and short. Blitz coming. Hurts in deep trouble. Gets away. Throws across his body. Incomplete. Willie Kay with the speed. And Hurts had nowhere to go. And the Chiefs defense hey. making a stand. What's up? What's up? What's up? That's how you do that. Three and out. Three and out. Outstanding job defensively coming out with a whole new tempo and tone. Feel it. Hey, trainer. And a three and out for the Eagles. Their first of the game. Come catch it. You're good. You're good. Let's go. End over end. Shorter punt. This ain't what they wanted now. And Tony will take it low at the 35. Now cuts back to the right. He's got a wall set. If he can get to the edge, they can either block the putter. They do. Tony's at the 40, up the sideline. At the 30, he's at the 20. Tony with the block trying to stay in play. He's down to the five-yard line. They'll have first down and goal to go at the Eagles' five-yard line. The longest punt return in Super Bowl history has the Chiefs set up first and goal. Hey, punch it in. Punch it in. Punch it in. This ain't what they won. 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 Hey, y'all know we turned Sit down. Sit down. Yes. Sit down. We might have to go back yes. out. Sit down. Sit down. Everybody sit down. Hey, Willie. Everybody have a seat. We're going to go back out in a few. Have a seat. Catch your breath. All hard. All hard. Strain it, baby. Strain it, Joe. Like I said, all hard. We have to put up seven. We have to put up seven. Focus and energy. Let's go. Third down, goal to go at the four yard line of hey. Philadelphia. Hey, my 57 wide. It's cover zero. Set. A fast left side, wide open, Sky Moore, touchdown! Kansas City! Man wide open, touchdown Chiefs and Sky Moore! On a pivot route, and Kansas City has a chance now to get up by eight points on a four yard touchdown pass by Holmes to Sky Moore. Let's keep going. Not done yet. Let's go. Let's get another one. Let's 
It's right there. Strain. 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 Let's go. Let's Ten go. minutes. Let's go, dog. Let's fucking go, man. Hey, did you know we were in the wrong formation? Yeah, I did. I, I, I went. I went left hash. I was trying to get the cover zero protected. And then I looked. I looked out to the right and tried to motion. And KT pointed that way. I was like, get. <laughs> Hey, we're not done, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, right about now. They got somebody's shirts in them hallway. Feel me, bro? They got somebody's shirts in the hallway, bro. Eagles down by eight after leading by ten. Again, the Eagles only had one fourth quarter comeback all season, and that was at Indianapolis. Back to throw, pressure up the middle. Looking for someone, nothing there for Hurt. They gotta stay disciplined against this Philly team. Super Bowl 57, Lombardi Trophy on the line. Quick snap, fake handoff, they're throwing long and deep. They got a man wide open, it's Smith. Going deep, got a man, Devontae Smith! Push it in. First and goal, they try to shot Hurts over the end zone, waiting for a signal. He's in, touchdown, Eagles. Go, baby, it's on us. Oh, we got two still. And now they have to go for two for the tie, you would think. Hey, don't nobody gotta be great. Let's go. We just lock in. We just lock in and play for each other, dog. Hurts, sprint out action to the near side. He wants to run the ball. He's gonna be hit. And he gets into the end zone to tie it 35 apiece. The game is tied and the Chiefs will have the ball in five minutes and 15 seconds. The Chiefs have had three straight touchdown drives. Hey, hey, all the marbles on the line for each other, baby. For each other. Cut. Mahomes in the pocket, works the sideline. Smith Schuster with the catch. Clean pocket, great blocking up front. The nature of this defense, it's to stress the quarterback. And right now, Patrick Mahomes is just picking him apart. Slant caught Kelsey. He's got the catch. Third and one. Pacheco's trying to get outside left tackle. He's at midfield. Chiefs first down in Eagles territory. Oh, we ain't getting on the field no more. It's over with. It's over with, Bob. We ain't touching that field no more. Pacheco's the running back. Tony comes in motion. Here comes pressure to the outside as Mahomes steps up. He's going to scramble. He's at the 40, bad ankle, 30. Bad ankle, 20. from behind 25 yard scramble <laughs> don't underestimate how tough Patrick Mahomes is he's given everything he has right now and he's fighting through some stuff Mitch the Chiefs started this game 0 for 3 on third down now they're 4 for 7 hey, hey, it's time to get down go, I just go. need your ass to strike hey I'm with you baby I'm with you. everything you got two minutes to go in Super Bowl 57 now the Chiefs have third down and eight Mahomes, pressure, lofting one, end zone incomplete. Juju Smith-Schuster couldn't catch up. There's a flag at the 10. Holding, 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 holding. Prior to the pass, holding, number 24, defense. Church mode right now. We're going to run it three straight times. Church mode, church mode, church mode. First down and goal to go at the 10, and the Eagles have just one timeout left. Yes, yellow, yellow. Set. McKinnon on a counter. Let's see what he decides to do here. Go down. He's got to get down. He's got to get down. Angling to the five. And he's going to slide down at the one. Very smart inbounds. He did not go into the end zone. Let's try to let him go. There we go. Bless. The Eagles are out of timeouts. Slow Neil. 
Slow nil. Now they will take the clock down. Hey, it's red, right, tight, regular victory. The beat firm on Sunday. It's a dream. You always watch the Super Bowl with your family and your friends and have a Super Bowl party. And to be able to be in that game, it's special. And it's something that you dream about as a little kid, but you dream about winning it. Embrace this moment. Everything we work for is for this moment. I think just about anybody who plays the game, um, you know, envisions themselves playing for a Super Bowl. You grow up watching this game. It's the biggest game on earth. You know, everybody around the world watching it, and there's nothing more I can ask for, pretty much. That's so why you keep your head up and you know, you never know. I said it once and I'll say it again, baby. It's one of the greatest feelings I've ever had in my life, man. To be on top of that mountain with the guys that I did it with. Oh, let's go! We needed it! Professionally, there's nothing like it. I mean, you win that son of a gun, uh, you've conquered the world. You always plan to have a chance to win it all. It's a great feeling. Uh, hard to explain exactly. That's all our life's worth. One of those things you dreamt of as a kid. I think about it every day. So the Chiefs will set up for a Super Bowl 57 game winning field goal. If you raise the Lombardi Trophy, that means you're the best football team in the world. Butker, who was the hero of the game against Cincinnati with that 45 yarder. And now Andy Reid will put him out there. A 27-yard attempt for the lead. It's an amazing honor, and that's why you, you play the game. 11 seconds left in Super Bowl 57, 35, 35, tied. The kick is good, and Kansas City leads 38-35 with eight seconds to go in regulation in Super Bowl 57. Watch the ball! Watch the ball! d -Lund. Watch the ball! Try to set up one final play. Pretty clearly desperation mode. Six seconds left in Super Bowl 57 regulation. Hertz takes the snap. Clock is going to be out of time. Here we go. Hertz. And the pass is going to be... Underthrown! It's incomplete! It's incomplete! Everyone, everyone who claims the Chiefs' kingdom will raise a banner above the National Football League again. Chiefs are champions of Super Bowl 57. Uh. Oh my God, bro. Oh my God, bro. Oh. All right, here you go. Oh. oh, that's the real deal. Oh. 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 How about it, Joe? It's me. Mama! <laughs> Mama! I'm so happy. <laughs> I love you, Mama. How about this, huh? I had the week of your life, I had the year of my life. How about this, huh? <laughs> love you. Hey. I ain't never seen nothing like you. You do it. <laughs> you do it. I, love I love you. I love you now, baby. Right? You know I do. Oh, damn you. Oh, yes! They probably believe in me, big guy, huh? <laughs> I owe you my life, big guy. This is the funnest ever, man. The funnest stuff ever. Two time, baby. Two time. Two time. Can't tell us nothing, baby. Philadelphia, you did a great job. It was a great game. But how about those cheese? <laughs> Not 
Patriots, their third Super Bowl championship, four, 54. They didn't wait 50 years for this one. They get it twice in four seasons. And now there are so many things that are put in motion of the history that was made in this game. This team did it the way they've done it all year long, and that is to fight and scrap. They were not expected to do this. What a night. The Chiefs win another one. You win two, it changes your legacy. Celebration continues. The Chiefs are Super Bowl champions for the second time in four years. And get ready, Kansas City and all of the Chiefs kingdom, to welcome home your champions. That's what I'm saying, bro. That's crazy, Is it heavy? I heard it last night, but I don't remember who said that. The Chiefs, in a five-year span, won more games than any organization in the history of the league. Five consecutive AFC championship games, hosting all five of them. They've been to the Super Bowl three times. They've won two of them. She's shy, everybody. She's shy, okay? Yeah, she don't like all that attention. In the history of the National Football League, there are teams that plant their flag to let you know that we were here. Talked about getting this one for Andy and getting that second one for Andy. And now, in my opinion, he goes down in immortality officially on the Rushmore of NFL coaches. It's Belichick, it's Reed, it's Walsh, and it's Schumann. What he's doing right now is setting records and becoming more remarkable by the day. Andy Reid is officially on the four greatest coaches monument in, in NFL history, in my opinion. Kansas City, the Chiefs are the premier organization now in the NFL. Now we can say there's a parade on Wednesday. That's all. <laughs> all we have to do is wait till today.